Hey guys, it's Warrior Chicken. Welcome back to Alienless Isolation. So our current objective is to follow Samuels. <laughs> and we already did that, so that's gonna have to be updated soon. But we are told that we are to take the private transit to the Apollo Core, where I'm assuming we're gonna get our next objective. So I'm very excited for this episode, particularly to go to the Apollo Core because Obviously, if you watched the uh, last episode, uh, when Samuels was trying to connect with Apollo, um, as soon as that finished and all that happened, he said that when we get to the Apollo core, it's going to talk to us. And he quote said, I wanted Amanda Ripley to have closure. And I'm not sure what direction that is going to take, whether it be with Ellen Ripley or just kind of this whole mystery of Sevastopol, but I'm really excited to see what that's going to be. You're on the floor above the Apollo core. This whole area contains Apollo supportive systems with the AI core itself at the center. Apollo prevented Samuels from lifting the lockdown remotely, but once you're inside, he makes sure it'll at least talk to you. I wonder what that means though, it's gonna talk to me. Is it gonna be like, hey Ripley, what's up? Or, <laughs> I don't know, I, I don't really know what to expect. Oh, sweet. I think at the uh, end of last episode, I was complaining that we were running out of loot, but here we go. here they go, just spoiling me at the very beginning of this episode. That never usually happens. <laughs> but our flares are maxed out as usual. Fuck the flare. <laughs> Alrighty, Tomorrow Together Part 3. Is this Julia's book? Oh no, no, this one is Sebastian Sieg. I wonder if that means for Siegson. I wonder if that's <laughs> like an alter ego name. Our ascent to Sevastopol. When Siegson prepared for its ascension into colonial space, its foothold was under construction. Sevastopol, a station with unparalleled potential in a perfect position deep in deep space. Sevastopol began as a free port built by Lauren Sistek Development and funded by our friends at Geofund Investor. The station's opening world, however, coincided with tumult in the space race. Years of mismanagement and the rerouting of the sole fetus flight path left Sevastopol in real danger of being discommissioned. Decommissioned. Thankfully, Siegson was waiting in the wings to re energize the station, among many others. In 2124, we arrived in Sebastopol and made possible the buzzing cosmopolitan hub you see today. Oh, it's buzzing, all right. I've come over to Apollo to find out what sent the synthetics crazy. This place has gone to hell. Apollo's redirected core android duties, and they've just walked away from the maintenance we requested after we got the news. Coolants everywhere, gas has escaped, and the primary access lift has shut itself down. I flagged the help request, but apparently I'm 45th in line. Systems are suddenly obsessed with hazard containment. I'm gonna find a way down. Spreading out. All right, so this is not new, new news to us because we already have been harassed by androids going, hazard containment, level omega. <laughs> so I guess, uh, guess that was, wait, was that Spedding or was that someone talking to Spedding? Ah, crap, I totally forgot. Okay, what else is over here? Okay, this is the way we're going. You've got to be shitting me. On security what? Did it just say firearms? Detected? Oh my god. Ripley, you're right. You've got to be shitting me! Wait, what did it say to do? Yeah, that's the way we have to go. No, I don't- I don't want to. Wait, okay, firearms. We only technically have two firearms, a shotgun and a revolver. I don't know if the flamethrower counts. I will be upset if that's what <laughs> I am. I'd be, be oh my god, it's a fire thrower. Of course it counts as a firearm. God damn. I'll bet. Oh my god. I better be getting these back later. 
Wow, look at me! I was saving up all my ammo for a big event like this, and then they take it away. I do this in, like, literally all video games. I remember I did that. Okay, are you still not gonna open? This is a joke. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Sucks, this sucks. I was really hyped for this episode, but now I'm not anymore. Core access elevator offline. Primary Apollo systems inaccessible. Ricardo, the way in's blocked off. The schematics they use for the Sevastopol sales tour should be nearby. See if there's a back door. A back door? Okay. Wait, where the heck is this leading? This isn't leading me anywhere. Oh, oh! Okay, let's see. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. I can use that. You think you'll fit? Turn off the electrics, take some deep breaths, squeeze. Easy. I'm not coming up there to pull you out if you get stuck. Wow, thanks, Ricardo. Nice to know you're looking out for me. Like how I'm looking out for you. I should have just whacked him and <laughs> I should have just whacked him again. Oh, you deserve that. Wait, is this the passcode? Try to remember this time. <laughs> 4930. That's the most passive aggressive passcode. <laughs> 4 9 3 0 4 9 3 0. And it's safe station. My favorite thing. Okay, is there anything else over here? No? Okay. Well, let's. Excuse me. <laughs> let's see. I'll have to power it down first. Oh man, the fact that like I already know that this is gonna be this is gonna be a very claustrophobic episode if we're gonna be squeezing through this stuff and it's gonna be even more scary you knowing if I get stuck. Ricardo is clearly being a bitch and he's just gonna sit up with a bunch of dead people and rule a whole office full of dead people. So. I don't actually know who will really have it worse, but at least we know that there's no aliens or androids that'll be in the vent. So if I die, at least I'll die peacefully alone in silence, you know? Was this one of these space sho- no, it was a space shower. Remember those space showers? Remember the torrents? Yeah, I still remember the torrents. I'm probably gonna forget soon, but <laughs> oh, happy times. Um, I don't think we've had anything kind of looking like Sevastopol in the Alien movies. I think it was just the Torrens was the one where I was like, Oh my god, I feel like I'm in an Alien movie. But this cosmopolitan hub is- Oh, something's- Oh, uh, that doesn't look good. <laughs> That is definitely an android in a jumpsuit. Yeah, that- why is he wearing that? His eyes red? Oh yeah, his eyes are red. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do some hacking, I guess. <laughs> Can we just blow that room up? So I don't have to deal with them because I don't have anything to deal with them with? Actually, wait. It was just firearms, so... Ricardo, conduits offline for now. I've pulled up the Apollo schematics here. It looks like you can get to the access to the turbine shaft. There'll be an emergency shut off nearby, but it won't stay off forever. You'll have to get inside quickly. Wait, is this like a time thing? Wait, where is that? Am I able to see where it is before I go? <laughs> I don't- <laughs> I'm gonna screw this up. I don't like anything that- I have to get all the way- Oh wait, no, I have to go there to shut it off. Okay, I was gonna say, if I have to, like, get from here to there. Okay, that's good. Let me just play this thingy. Ray, it's Chief. There's something wrong with your synthetics. The team I requisitioned to acid strip lower habitation just stopped in their tracks. They bought something about a hazard containment order, tried to get into my control booth, and then just marched off. I know I always complain about those spooky bald bastards, but now I've got proof their wiring's faulty. I've got a meeting with your boss Spedding tomorrow, and I'm gonna kick some ass. So when he starts kicking your ass, well, it's coming from me. 
All right, that was that was kind of harsh. Um, I'd be okay if he went and kicked Ransom's ass, because that's the only ass I really want to kick at this point. But <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm just like like my controller is vibrating like crazy. I already know that these these androids are gonna be a huge problem, and I don't know if it's just because they're like wearing like orange jumpsuits because um they are like <laughs> like they're more powerful. But I don't think they give us more powerful androids if we don't have any firearms to use. Or maybe they will. <laughs> well, I guess we'll see. Okay. Did I turn it off? Do I have to run now? Warning. Turbine's off. Turbine Way should be clear. Oh, it's this thing! Okay. Wait, is it this? Oh, shit. No, it wasn't. Wait, what is it? Where am I going? What? Ew. I'm so confused. Wait, no, there's no- <laughs> God damn it, Flair. <laughs> Where is it telling me to go? Oh. oh. Okay. Got a little bit confused for a second. <laughs> Axis Apollo. Oh, I can see why she said- Ah, this isn't that tight in here. This actually isn't too bad. Okay, Apollo. Oh, okay. Actually, I think this is where we're gonna get that tight squeeze. This is gonna be tight. Good luck. Ripley, you're getting deeper into Apollo and your radio signal's getting faint. I'm gonna lose you soon. Well, it's not like you were much help anyway. Just keep him cross for me, huh? There's gonna be lots of drones down there, Rip. Could be dangerous. Samuel sacrificed himself so I could get here. I've gotta try. I thought he was a pretty nice guy for a synthetic. Cool. Me too. Yeah, he was. Oh, safe point. Oh man, I miss Samuels. Need him more than ever now. Ricardo, the main entrance is locked. Any idea what to do next? I can't hear you, Rick. Your signal's just in the straight. Ricardo? If you can hear me, find another way to make contact. Something's up with my earpiece. You hear that? As soon as I look at it, the entire, like, soundtrack completely changes. Okay. So he went in there, so... I'm assuming that's where I gotta go. Well, I'm just gonna take a little peek and see what we're working with, and then we're gonna come back in this room. Okay, okay, never mind. No, no, no. That is why they're wearing those hazmat suits, is because it's poisonous. <laughs> oh my god. That's just freaking great. Oh, okay, there's a door over here. I see. No, I'd much rather go through that door because there's no, uh. Oh, well, I hope it doesn't lead to the same place, so that'll be pretty useless. Hazard containment alert. Apollo would ask for your patient during the hazard containment alert, which is currently level Omega. <laughs> Thank you. Obviously. I literally hate the word Omega now. I just, oh, I just, you know, I've gotten so many, like, trigger words that just make me so angry now when I hear them. One, hysterical. Two, Omega. Three, Ransom. Crazy just happened. Sebastopol is off the market. We got a buyer. The weeks before they start taking the place apart, <laughs> they U-turn. After all those endless presentations and tours, I guess... The talks weren't stalled at all. Someone at company headquarters just had to click his fingers. A message of confirmation just came in. Apollo's currently receiving a packet of new operation rule sets. So, I guess, the deal's sealed. Now, this is board-level need-to-know stuff until it's announced to shareholders. Quite the promotion, huh? <laughs> there it is! <laughs> I was about to get really, really triggered because I know some people were saying that I should start like backtracking to um, previous areas, but <laughs> I was gonna say, oh my goodness, if I miss the gas mask somewhere. Okay, well this just solved all my problems. I was definitely about to get really, really, really angry, but all is good. Oh, but the vision is so crap in this. <gasps> I don't like this at all. Okay, and there's sparky things everywhere. Okay. We're gonna have to go full stealth mode now. 
with androids. I don't know how much they're gonna buy all of this. Actually, okay, so, oh shit, we only have one stun baton. That's not good. We have noisemakers, smoke bombs, flashbang. Okay, actually, I'm gonna try out a Molotov, I think, first. Yeah, let's try Molotov first. Oh, it was just that little section there. Okay. Now we just gotta do some recon right now. Wait, where is he? Why is it saying that it's like right here? Is he above me? This is very concerning. I know there's one in here though. <laughs> okay, yep, he's right there. <laughs> Sorry guys, a little bit panicked. Okay, good. Good, you don't see me. Oh, there's a vent there. That doesn't look like the way it's where we're supposed to be going, so I'm not gonna take it. I swear to God, y'all y'all don't see me. No one saw anything. Warrior chick was not here. Oh, sorry, Ripley. <laughs> No! Irresponsible! Oh my god. <laughs> Be careful with that. What do I use? <laughs> Let me in. <laughs> I need more time to think about this. Stun baton! Oh, I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Where did all my health go? Oh no. Kate, okay. did did I miss this? I swear I had full health. Oh shoot, it was probably because I kept running into the gas room. Oh no. Who said that? Who said that? Oh my- oh my god, you've got it! oh! <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? I have nothing that works! Please? Give me a locker? Oh my gosh! This is the worst! This is the worst! <gasps> okay, I think we're gonna have to play a little bit of hide and seek here, guys! <laughs> Okay, at least I can make a med kit. Let's quickly do that while we're here. Okay, they're coming in. They're coming in. I have literally nothing to fight with. You know what? I will use a smoke bomb. Worst comes to worst. God, I I hate you. I hate you. I hate you all. I hate you. I don't even know if that's gonna work because they're fucking robots. What? 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 I wanted that locker and then you ruined it! <laughs> Please stop it! Please just stop. <laughs> Please. Guys, this is actually worse than the alien, you know? <sighs> you know what exactly what I'm picturing right now? Um, I'm currently also playing Dark Souls and no. And usually they leave little messages saying like, ambush ahead or lying in ambush and like I just I want to be able to leave a message for the next person okay there's no no fucking way you know I'm in here
Facility clear. What? You just gave the all clear. them um it's just usually every time i try to go with the maintenance jack it never works like i always end up getting strangled somehow so okay at least that's one down oh, i don't think i saw this terminal in here initialize emergency coolant flow Injury or death? Yes. Yes. Die. <gasps> Does it kill androids so? <laughs> How do I take my gas mask off? I thought she automatically took it off, but now I have a freaking... Okay, we gotta play this one a little bit better. I'm not doing a good job right now, guys. Um, it's easier to hide from the <laughs> freaking alien than it is for these fucking guys. Okay, let me lead you out here so you can die too. Oh, shoot, actually, I think. Oh, it killed a lot of them. How many were out here? Okay, maybe I can just like lose him over here. God damn. That didn't kill him! Oh my goodness. Wait, what does that rewire do? <gasps> Jesus, finally! Okay, how am I just fighting all these like little things now? What the heck? What does this do? Gas divert active. Oh, I remember that's the thingy that um we used in the last episode that caused the fire to come out and kill all the androids, but I don't particularly know how that is helping us over here. I swear there was a terminal in here though. I think I'm missing something. Okay, there's an android in there. So we're gonna have to be very quiet or just beat him with a wrench. Wait, I thought he was in here. I hear him, but I don't see him. Okay, maybe he's leaving. Where, what's the thing he's saying? Okay, yeah, he's leaving. Okay, let's save so I don't have to do this shit again. All right, perfect. Our objective is right here. <laughs> do some more hacking. Okay. Uh, blank egg. How do you do this again? There we go. Okay. Um. There we go. So you guys a little confuffled. Now active. Right hemisphere server banks. Now active. There it is. There's the left left servers. Exactly where the other android went. Fuck, I why'd they gotta take my fucking guns? I hate this game. I hate it. Wait, search the right now. I'm confused. Or does it want me to do two? It wants me to do two. Okay, we're gonna go to the left one first, I guess. <laughs> Apollo, there are androids at the door. Rare seems nowhere to be seen. There are conflicts with the hazard containment breach. Synthetic safety procedures are getting bypassed left and right. Comms are offline. I thought it was random, but I'm not so sure. Oh god, I gotta get in. Tell Susan I'm Fuck, I don't have any more pipe bombs. Ah, you've got to be shitting me. Oh my god. Be disabled. <gasps> That's 
That's not fair. That's not fair. Oh my god, I literally can't do fucking shit in this game. And there's no emergency overrides. There's literally fucking nothing. Okay. If I power these up, one of them should give me access to a power security bands. Well, I guess we're gonna have a lot of backtracking to do in this one because I can't seem to fucking do anything. Okay, use the access tuner on the dome terminal. Okay, I can do that. <laughs> oh, is there more to turn on? Where are they? <clears throat> they looking for me. Okay, there's a locker over there. Ah, no! It's not your business what I'm doing here. Oh my fucking god! My fucking god, I fucking hate this game. Leave me alone! Can't I do anything to blow these guys up? Yes, 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 let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Was it- No! God damn it. They know I'm in here now. Why is this so hard, guys? Okay, apparently this is the way you're supposed to go the whole time, so... I didn't really, uh, miss anything. <laughs> I mean, I may have in that previous room, but, like, oh my god, guys, I'm not going back there. We can do that another time once we get our guns back. This fucking sucks. Oh, thank god, a save station. Alrighty, okay, I don't think there's any androids in here, so we might be good for a few seconds. Wait, where's the thingy? What? I can't even- Guys! do that? I can't even fucking hack anymore. I can't do any fucking thing in this game anymore. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> what does this do? I have no idea what that did. Oh great, now we gotta worry about the android again. Just seriously guys, this is actually- <laughs> <laughs> this has been the worst part of it. Okay, just watch. Look how small that area is and I get one second. This doesn't... This doesn't seem right. I, I, I don't know if my thing's glitching or if it's actually this difficult. Why do I only get one second? Please tell me that this is a joke. I don't know, so we're just not gonna do that because I actually think it's impossible, so we're gonna go this way. Gosh, you guys, seriously, this episode? Oh, is this one I'm supposed to- I don't even like this one either. This- this all sucks. Okay, let's take a peek seeds out here and see if this thingy works now. Okay, there we go. There we go. That's ridiculous, guys. I Oh my god, I'm not going to do it in time. I'm not going to do it in time. Come on, come on. Oh my god. Look at that. Consult with Apollo. Yes, we have some consulting to do, Apollo. Why is everything shaking? Where do, oh, oh, I can actually do it in here? Like here? How do I get in there? Or do I have to go up? How do I go up? <laughs> well, why is my everything <laughs> shaking? <laughs> Tell me where to go, please. Oh, it's moving up. This seems so suspicious. <gasps> Oh, it's this room! I don't think anything's ever come good from the movies when they've gone in this room, but it's so pretty, it's just... Makes me feel like I'm on a spaceship, you know? I mean, we are in space, so... <laughs> but, you know, it's just... 
Oh, it's so good. What the hell? Two days after we left. You're kidding me. On the damn station. What? what? <laughs> Fuck. They really just told me to go fuck myself. Oh my god. Waylon Yutani, you've done it again. God damn it. Oh, okay, now we have to climb down. Shut the fuck up, Waylon Yutani. I should have known they were behind all of this. I should have known. Protect specimen at all costs. That's so funny. Two days after they left, what are the chances? I'm really actually excited. So, I know I keep saying this, but you guys started talking a lot in the comments about Detroit Become Human. And um, that game is supposed to be... Um, all about androids so naturally now that i've played this game i don't want to play it <laughs> i mean i'm going to it's gonna come after heavy rain but you know some people were saying that it's gonna be a very very different um i don't want to say outlook perspective but a very kind of different like for example we have samuels and we have these um these orange fuckheads hanging around here and obviously we all have two very different opinions on them, so I'm very, very excited to see um, what the playthrough is going to be like for that game because I already kind of have a sour taste in my mouth from these androids. <laughs> but then again, is it the androids or is it just Waylon Yutani? So I feel like I can't really discriminate against androids at this point. Okay, Apollo primary interaction log. 1111. 2137. Human interaction. Request for intercorporate messaging received. Outgoing message to Wayland Utani. Representatives accepted and monitored. Colonial Marshall incident report. Temporary emergency measures initiated in San Cristobal Medical Facility. No information provided. External interaction. Purchase order received. Wayland Utani. Operational rule set. Packet received. Verified and installed. Colonial Marshall Incident Report. Emergency measures initiated in San Cristobal Medical Facility extended. No further information provided. Station scans initiated under Wayland Utani Directive. Fuck you, Wayland Utani. Containment Hazard Alert! Omega! <laughs> Unverified scans in reactor system. Special Order 939 initiated. Okay, so this is when the whole, you know, kind of crew expendable thing happened. Priority 1 protects specimen. Maintain station quarantine. Disallow communications. Sevastopol arrivals log. New inhabitants logged with Apollo systems by synthetic staff. Ripley, Amanda, level 2, Wayland Utani. That's me! Taylor, Nina, level 4, Wayland Utani. Samuels, Christopher, level 3, Wayland Utani. Wait, why are they higher levels than me? What does that mean? Expandable! <sighs> Yo, God damn, you know, when you watch the movies, it's one thing to hate Waylon Utani, but when you are Amanda Ripley and Waylon Utani calls you expendable, no one calls Amanda Ripley expendable. God damn, it just, bad luck runs in the family. Containment hazard alert. Visible threat to specimen detected in Project KG348 Hazard Lab. Containment hazard alert raised to Omega. So Omega this whole time had to do with, wait, Project KG348, that was when... Marshall Waits betrayed us and sent us out with the alien. I wonder if that's going to be the aliens kill them all because they technically got rid of the alien. <gasps> oh my gosh, all these things are just coming together. It's just too much. Keep things quiet. Spedding, it's ransom. With the Wayland Utani buyout, it's more important than ever that the flight recorder handover goes without a hitch. There'll be low level execs and won't know jack about the buyout. But if they hear rumors about a disappearing people problem, well, I don't want to rock the boat, and neither do you. Let's just keep everything nice and quiet. We don't want them having second thoughts. 
God, they just keep making me hate them more and more. Wow. Wow, this was seriously a very unfortunate mother-daughter moment, like in Alien when we um, got to go into that room, you know, with all the little lights. I'm not sure what that room is actually called. What's the news? Apollo's running the Boon and Yutani protocols. This one? Zeke's and sold out. Wing and Yutani are in control of Apollo now. It's refusing to lift the lockdown. It says there's something up with the reactor. You're from the company. Tell it you don't give a shit and to do what you say. Sorry, Ricardo, but I'm small fry. Me, Samuels, Taylor, we all are. I guess if we amounted to anything, Apollo wouldn't be so ready to see us killed. Okay, those ones are the normal, Andrew. Oh my god, no, then they got an orange fuck with them. Great! Investigate the central reactor. This is gonna be really fun. Okay, that's Apollo Core. How do I get there? Um, excuse me, motion tracker. <laughs> Where are you bringing me? Oh, okay, I'll take all that though. Something weird's happening. Synthetics are on the fit, so I found some guys to help me out. I sent one of them to a manufacturing room, but he never came out. Every door is locked. I'm sure as hell couldn't fit through the air vent without a fight. We don't know what to do. It doesn't seem right to keep working without looking for them, but there's nowhere to look. Our ship's over soon. Our incident awaits in the marshals. You know, it's kind of just crazy just hearing all the stories of how everybody else starts to kind of find out what... Um, I know I keep asking this, but I wonder what the timeline is for being able to find um, all of this all this stuff out. You know, every time we see those little things like San Cristobal, um, you know, you wonder if when all these messages were being recorded, if that's where you were at that time. So it's definitely really, really fun to kind of see that. And I can't wait to kind of get more of those extra stories. Ooh, there we go. Okay, I was really getting stuck. Guys, seriously, I apologize that this episode has been an absolute disaster. I don't know if I'm just off my game or I was just very dependent on firearms. <laughs> but this, this guy, seriously, you've never seen me struggle this much. And I don't think I've ever struggled this much, even with the alien. I would say definitely the hardest episode by far was probably the one in medical. Nope. Great. Okay, good. I still have one charge. Back from when I tried- <laughs> when I respawned after trying to use it. Okay. You're good. Do we got more in line? I know they like to ambush. Surprising. Okay. Let's turn off these cameras. And actually, I don't even know what our current objective is, so I should probably check that out. Let's put on the unstable system. I feel like things getting a little unstable in here. Okay, so our current objective is to investigate the central reactor. Apollo will not downgrade the hazard containment alert due to an unknown presence within the central reactor. Oh boy, I'm so excited to see what that means. Oh great, flares. Did I say cat? No, meat. Mmm. Mmm, <laughs> wrapped meat. Delicious. Okay. A few ways we can go here. Oh, okay. I wonder if they're gonna prepare me with a bunch of loot. Cutting torch upgrade. Ion flame available. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, I think that actually might be the last tool that we needed. That at least I can remember. It was the gas mask and that, so. Oh, and a map upgrade. It's been a while since I've had this. Oh my gosh. Look at all that. We got a little bit of a ways to go, though, so... I'm assuming we're getting a whole bunch of... Bolt gun ammo. Uh... There's something else you should be giving me? Wayland Dutani? That I'm missing out on? Maybe a... maybe a bolt gun?
Also, I've never been able to figure these things out. Unfortunate. Where is my bolt gun? <laughs> See, it was exactly the same as the shotgun ammo, and I was like, hmm, there's shotgun ammo, but there's no shotgun. It's the same thing, but there's no bolt gun. Please tell me I'm just being a little bit blind. Please give me a bolt gun. God, this... That's just fucking great. Just great. <laughs> Guys, if I missed the bolt gun, I'm really sorry. I didn't see it, so... <laughs> Please don't get mad at me. Okay. Where are we supposed to go? Maybe this will lead me to the bolt gun. Oh! No, seriously, guys, I'm really, really excited to do the Crew Expendable DLC because I think someone at some point was saying that the, the characters you can play as were Parker, Ripley, or Dallas. Um, I don't know. I think Lambert was kind of debatable. I've never seen him, but I'm not sure if she was a confirmed character or not. So I think it'd be really, really cool. And I know some people are also saying that I'm going to be getting, well, not I'm going to be getting, but I could find potential Easter eggs um, from the Alien movie. Or I guess I'm assuming at least to go with the original cast, because we did get that really, really cool one with Parker. Um, and I think that would just kind of really nicely um, help us find out more pieces of the story and maybe fill in a bit in Crew Expendable. So. I don't know, I'm kind of excited to see, like, those comparisons. Okay. I'm kind of spooky. <gasps> Can I drive that? Oh my gosh. Okay, we got an android patrolling right there. That I totally missed. Androids. Of course I'm missing one fucking piece to make more. Right, where are we supposed to go? <gasps> Come on, give me an objective! Oh my goodness. Find a way out of the engineering workshop. Oh, I, I gotta actually look for it. Great. I hate when I actually have to do work, you know? Okay, this is where we- Oh, that's where we came from. Oh, fuck you, man. All right, at least he wasn't in orange suit, you know? I wonder- I seriously do wonder what the difference is, like, and what was the point- Flame th- They gave me flamethrower fuel! They're just- they're- oh my god, they're- they're just teasing me right now, giving me all this really cool ammo. And then- <laughs> They're just like, but you can't use it! Same thing with a bolt gun! I mean, obviously now we're getting a bolt gun, but... I don't have it right now. Which would have been really nice. Okay, did that power up any doors? Oh, there's this thing here. Oh, okay. Restore power. What? I thought I just did restore the power. Am I missing something else? Power too low? Okay, so I guess we gotta figure out how to turn on the power? Is this it? Yes. Oh, see, I'm so smart. <laughs> I'm just sitting here, just... Where is it? All right, now which one of you guys are gonna turn on? Yes, okay. They're really testing me this episode, you know? This stuff probably wouldn't have been too hard. It's just, I feel like I've been spoiled throughout this entire playthrough, you know, having this little thingy tell me where to go, all my objectives, and you know, when they leave me on my own, you know, this is where things go to hell. It's just, Okay, if you're gonna make me work this hard, either take away my firearms and give me not-so-hard androids, not take away my firearms and give me freaking the Godzilla of androids, you know? That's still invalid. Take in my car! Why would you do that? <laughs> Took away my last hope. Can I do anything with this now? Oh, I see. Okay. 
Oh, at least this one's nice and wide. I don't get this, like, claustrophobic. I wouldn't really say I'm claustrophobic, but... I don't know why, particularly on airplanes, I get really, really bothered. Not sure. I guess maybe that means I wouldn't do too well in space. But then again, if I had something like the Torrens, you know, to fly to Disney World on, you know, I'd be okay with that. <laughs> get there and, like, I don't know how fast spaceships go. You know, maybe we can take some lessons from these space stations, you know, incorporated into real life. You know, I've always had a very uh, big fascination with space. I actually took an astronomy class, um, I think in my, I think it was my first or second year um, university. And <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> I do have a bad taste in my mouth from that class because I got a plagiarism strike and I was just really, I just hated the class after that. Not because of the content, I love the content, but <laughs> I just hated the class after that. Okay, this just led me back here. Did I just open up like an alternate exit? Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. Don't want to have to use all that brain power again. Okay, we got androids over there. Lots of androids. Unlock the shutter! Where's that? Okay, it's over there. Oh shit, there's no. Uh... See, bolt gun ammo! <sighs> Just pissing me off, man. Nope. Nothing is amiss. God damn, I have like nothing. I don't want to receive another of these. Stop fucking weaponizing the tools. Oh! Of course it's the orange one! Here, let's just... <laughs> I'm not running though, bro! Okay, let's bring him over here. And we'll just... We'll, we'll, we'll get out of here. No! I just trapped myself. Why do I always... He's totally not gonna know I'm in this cupboard. <laughs> He's totally not gonna know. Looking for you is wasting valuable company time. Then don't waste company time and do something useful. Oh my god, you're actually so stupid. Where else could have I gone? I'm sure this is a misunderstanding. Okay, I'm not gonna wait for the all clear this time because it never really works. I like it! Wait, what's for you? This little blue guy? I kinda want- <gasps> Is this it? This could really do some damage. Oh, thank god I didn't miss it. Mmm, look at that! Okay, that's it. It's over! I don't think he's coming back here, so I think it's safe to go on this. But then again, I have been attacked while I've been on a terminal before. Shutters code, Chief. I'm heading down to reactor maintenance now. As request, I've locked the shutters behind me. The code is 6832. Power delivery. We need you down in reactor maintenance, Flores. I've got reports of localized brownouts all over the station. I know it's going to hell on station, but I can't see anything up here that would be compromising power delivery. Can you run a full systems check down there? I'm coming to find you. Flores, if you're still there, find somewhere safe and wait. I'm coming down to you. We need to stick together now. Sanders is dead and at least four of the other engineers are missing. One of those damn androids nearly took my head off. So I've scavenged some parts together to make a weapon. It's got enough to kick a punch. Nice. Enough to kick to... Enough kick... Enough kick to punch a nice clean hole in one of those bastards. I'll be there as soon as I can. Oh shit, what was it? 6832. I know I keep saying this, but y'all are so stupid. You complain about getting hacked, then you put your password, like, right there for everyone to see. Get to the reactor. Oh, who's gonna be the first one to try out my bolt gun? Strange. What are you doing here? Wait, how does it work? How does it work? What?! Yes, it should work! 
Oh my fucking <laughs> I seriously think that this entire episode is just a fucking practical joke. Oh my god, they, they're fucking strong. <laughs> this entire episode is a fucking joke. <laughs> the fact that I got a trophy saying this should work just goes to show. Okay, where are we going? We're going this way. Goodbye. Do I have a med kit? We'll just quickly, uh, yup. Stab ourselves. Inject the juice, the sunny D. Let me in! Oh no, it's an elevator! <laughs> we'd have to wait for it. Okay. So, I've never used a bolt gun in any of the games, so I'm not really sure how it works, but I can already see it just as a single shot, so that's, that's not good. I don't really get it. The fact that they take away my firearms is the only one they leave me with. Kind of, kind of not happy, guys. Ricardo, you ever been to the reactor? <laughs> Did some training in one. Seems like a life. Why are you coughing, Ricardo? Was that me? Was that in the game, or, or am I just hearing things? I don't know. Central reactor. Woohoo! So excited. Okay, I'll take that. Take that flamethrower. Okay, I must be getting my flamethrower back then. So, yes, there's no reason to panic. Wait, was this mine? Or is this a new- this looks like a new one. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay, not complaining. I really wish I had this before, but I will take it. Oh my gosh, and- <laughs> A save station, finally! Alright guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I've been super triggered and angry and just- straight up frustrated with this game this entire episode <laughs> um i think i'm gonna leave the episode off here because i need a break i need to cool down before we continue into this reactor because that just sounds like a whole nother load of fun i'm not really willing to have now <laughs> i hope you guys still enjoyed this episode regardless of this absolute failure in disaster so i will see you guys in the next episode and we'll pick up from here bye